So basically I've mentioned what we're doing in this video. We're going to be learning how to or I'm going to show you how to mix your Nivea Q10 um, for skin lightening and that is for both face and body. Please watch this video to the end because I'm going to be mentioning some really important things to consider when using your Nivea Q10 to lighten your skin. my channel if you're new here my name is Dekan aka Deco Co aka Queen of DIYs and that is because I also have DIY videos on this channel so if you're someone that also likes to play with DIY things do things yourself or if you're an aspiring formulator or you just like to um, play around with things and learn new things and I definitely have DIY videos for you on this channel and if you're a returning subscriber you know you're my OG thank you so much for always tuning back in internet hugs to all of you please if you're subscribed and your notification bell is not turned on make sure that it is turned on so that you would be the first to get whenever I post a video and if you're not subscribed definitely make sure that you're subscribed please before we get into this video I wanted to drop a disclaimer out there we are all adults on this channel please I don't want anyone coming to the comment section if you do that fine but I just want to help you not to waste your time please don't come to this video telling us or telling people or attacking me that I'm helping people to lighten their skin or I'm encouraging people to lighten their skin and all of that. Listen, we are not babies and you as well shouldn't decide what people do with their skin, their bodies and all of that. You can just take a seat or you can just click out of this video if it's not your kind of thing, if it's not what you're interested in. Please don't come and preach to us. Please, I beg you today. It's not the day. I mean, whenever you're going to write that comment, it's not the day for that. Because it gets really annoying. There is real life problems. There is hyperpigmentation that we black women deal with. There is pot. There's lots of issues that we deal with that in one way or the other, we would have to lighten. There are some problems on the skin that make people feel insecure. So if people can walk their way around and actually treat some of those issues or treat those things that actually make them insecure, why are you so bothered and you are in the comment section attacking people you could just mind your business like it literally takes zero seconds to mind your business and it saves you both time and money and everything so just click out of this video if it's not for you please don't come for me today i'm not in the mood for you and i'm gonna come for you too okay so today is another skin deep with Deacon video and in this type of videos we share um, beauty secret tips and tricks to just help you better your skin we do product recommendations product reviews and all of that sort of stuff so we just talk about skin stuff so if you're interested basically if you have skin you should be on this channel and you should definitely make sure that you're subscribed so I wanted to mention that there's a little bit of a surprise in the work for you guys so um, if you want to find out what that is it's something that you guys have always been asking for on this channel if you're a skincare formulator if you're a skincare enthusiast and all of that definitely make sure to check my description bar to see what surprise that I have for you I have promised you guys this and finally I'm willing and able to open it to the entire um, or to my entire YouTube family it's something that I've been doing privately in a way but now I want to open it up to everyone so everyone can assess even though I'm still going to be able to handle just quite a number of people so yeah if you want to find out what that is definitely check out the description bar to make sure that you are not late to the party and trust me you do not want to be late to this party so without Without further ado, let us get into today's video. So in today's video, we're going to be discussing how to use your Nivea Q10 with vitamin C. And here is this one for the body and then the face cream. So I had shared a video on some tips and tricks to do with your body cream and your face cream to just help you better enhance the result that you get with your product. And in today's video, I've gotten some requests on how to do this. So I decided that this should be the next video for the fact that we are in the summer months, which means that we do need this type of hack. And also for the fact that most of my viewers view from Nigeria and it's usually like all year summer in Nigeria because it's basically almost hot all year. Yeah. so um, this hack would be highly beneficial for everyone well, I'm going to show you how to mix your Nivea Q10 um, for skin lightening and that is for both face and body 
So first I wanted to mention that using like a moisturizer or a cream or a lotion like the Nivea Q10 one to lighten your skin is one that I would advise especially for people that are just starting out skin lightening or if you're dealing with like hyperpigmentation and all of that stuff spots and all of that and you just want to start out with like lightening those areas up some dark patches on your body and everything I wanted to mention that mixing your lightening product this way is a good way to start um, with skin lightening. If you are a beginner with skin lightening and all of that, this is a very useful way for you. That way you don't go harm on your skin. And also if you're trying to just like maintain your skin tone, if you already have your desired result with like some of the products that you're already using, if you are skin lightening, and I don't always advise that you constantly use um, skin lightening products because it just stresses your skin to a place where at a point your skin is not going to take those lightening products anymore so a method like this would help to like maintain your skin tone if you've gotten to a beautiful tone that you would like to keep this kind of method can help you maintain that skin tone without going too harm on your skin without using a lot of product that could potentially damage your skin so to mix our face cream i'm going to be going in with an anti-reaction cream um, and also our face cream of course which is the nivea q10 face cream with vitamin c and also nature secret face cream you can use any lightning face cream of choice and um, also carotone serum and also a lightning water lotion and this one is called pigment C and now in a bowl and my spatula I'm going to be scooping my Nivea face cream into the bowl now you want to mix in a bowl that you can see so that you can do things properly and now I'm going to go in with this T-Dem anti um, reaction cream and now I'm using a gel cream instead of a tube cream so now I'm going in with my um, nature secret lightning cream and then I'm going to go in with um, some drops of my carotone serum and um, all the measurements will be in the description bar so you can know how to measure it properly and next I'm also going to be going in with my pigment C um, lightning water lotion and then I'm going to just stir that up and mix it thoroughly so I used a gel anti-reaction cream because my skin is oily and combination so you want to use a gel cream if your skin is oily and not the creamy one if not it's just going to make it too thick. So now after mixing my cream I'm then going to transfer it back into my face cream container and yeah this is what it looks like now and I'm just going to cover that up and yes we are done with our lightening face cream and you can apply it every day so now getting on with the body lotion I'm going to take my Nivea Q10 with vitamin C and then also a jug and a spatula to mix then I'm going to then turn in my lotion into the jug now you really want to pour out your lotion when you're working as well because you want to make sure that you mix things properly if not things can just be separated in the bottle if you just pour everything directly so now I'm going to go in with Befantanol and this is um, an emollient that helps in moisturizing the skin better and I'm just going to go in um, the cream that I have here is about 300 ml so I'm going to go in with um, the 30 grams of Bepantanol and next I'm going to be going in with an anti-reaction um, cream as well and then I'm going to pour that in there as well I'm going to squeeze that thoroughly into and then I'm going to mix it up properly so now I'm going to be going in with a lightning serum as well and this one is the Citro Clear lemon lightening serum and I'm going to be going in with two tablespoons of that and next I'm going to be going in with carrot oil and I had done a tutorial on how to make this carrot oil is a very strong and potent lightening carrot oil and also I put in three tablespoons of the carrot oil into the mix and then I am mixing up properly so I'll then transfer the now lightening cream into the container and here we have our skin lightening lotion and I'm just giving that a good shake and yeah 
I demonstrated this with like moderate products or moderate lightening um, products that you can mix with your cream just make it work better on your skin or give you like gradual results please if you're looking to lighten your skin in three days this is not for you if you're looking to lighten your skin in seven days this is definitely not for you and i would not advise that kind of lightening on your skin because doing that you're stressing your skin too much you're packing all these things on your skin that has the potential of shocking your skin and at some point you could be getting to deal with more damage than you initially planned or more damage than you were even trying to repair in the first place. I do see some videos where people mix like five to six or three to four five six lightning tube creams and then some more lightning oils and some more serums and all of that i would definitely definitely not recommend that i feel like it's really um selfish and damaging to the skin when you all when you throw all these things into your creams and your lotions and all of that to just get this fast action rapid action believe me it is really damaging to the skin and here on youtube i have had to like deal with a lot of people that have experienced a lot of damage on their skin due to this kind of skin cream mixing pro mixing and all of that so please what i am trying to do here on this channel is to help you to do things moderately or do things safely to your skin um safely with a quote you know um to your skin because i know somebody can still come for me that it's not safe but yeah whatever the case i am trying to help you to stay moderate with your skin and i bring you this kind of advice when it has to do with skincare because i see that there are um, lots of videos on youtube that advise you to do things um, in really really crazy manners and proportions so i'm trying to help my followers my subscribers to stay moderate or anybody that just comes across my video to stay moderate and see good results as well and have beautiful skin still um, without going too extreme or too hard on your skin so yeah i also wanted to mention something that i'm always going to preach on i'm sure some of you can already um guess what i'm trying to talk about make sure to use your body lotions with sunscreen definitely 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 make sure to use sunscreen it is so important i cannot overemphasize the importance of sunscreen for our skin we need sunscreen more than we need our body lotion our body moisturizers do you get the point now we need sunscreen sunscreen is like your best bet at a beautiful skin especially with skin lightening you need to protect your skin from the sun because now it makes our skin more open more prone to sun damage so now you want to make sure that after you use all this your skin goodies your skin products and all of that you definitely make sure that your skin is protected with sunscreen to just help the beautiful products that you've applied on your body on your face and all of that just work better or give it a chance at working better you don't only have to do this with nivea q10 um with vitamin c you can do this with your regular body lotion the one that you personally love this is my regular moisturizer um that i like for my skin and also you don't have to use the nivea q10 with vitamin c if you do have a special one that you already like um, um, like I know that the people in Nigeria have access to the Nivea Fairness Lotion. So most people tend to use that. So yes, you can always do that as well with that one. If you do try this, please come back to this video and drop a comment down below. If you're already doing something like this with your cream, or if you do have any comments or questions or anything, just drop it down below. I would do well to get to your comments, your question, and all of that. Please subscribe if you're not subscribed yet and click on the notification bell so you get notified every single time that I post a video. And I'll be coming up with more Skin Deep with Decam video for you guys. I have a lot in the works. I have a lot of videos that I'm working on that you're definitely going to love and appreciate. Thank you so much for watching this video at the end of this video i'm going to link two videos that you can check out a playlist and a video that if you just want to have some more skin goodie and please do thumbs up this video if you haven't yet thank you so much for watching and as usual i wish you guys a beautiful glowy perfect and luscious skin and i will see you guys in my next one Mwah.